Happy Halloween, everyone. Welcome back. Thank you for joining me again. I hope you had an amazing week. In the spirit of Halloween, I decided to do my video on Halloween so I could come to you in my Halloween costume. So bear with me. <laughs> we'll start off the video, of course, doing our 15 seconds forgiveness, love, and gratitude boost. As usual, put your hands on your chest, say, I forgive you, I love you, and send immense love and gratitude right there. Ready? Begin. There you go. Congratulations on healing yourself 15 seconds at a time. And please, please, please feel free to do that exercise as often as you want throughout the day. So um, a lot of times I get inspired to do my talks on things that I pick up in everyday life. So when I got this costume, it came with a veil. So it made me think about relationships or a bride. And with that, it made me think about loyalty. And this is not a relationship video at all, but just like any relationship, there needs to be some loyalty. You know, you can't be with a significant other and be constantly thinking about other people or wishing or looking at the other grass on the other side of the street and expect your relationship to last because it won't. You know, something has to be sacrificed for something else. So you need to be have, have some loyalty to that relationship. So, but just like that, any goal, dream, or desire you have, you have to be loyal to that. And you can't flirt with fear and laziness and um, anything that goes along that's gonna stop you from being loyal to your dreams and desires. You know, if you have, um, if you want to be more loving and forgive more or just have a, a more happier life, you can't flirt with holding grudges and hatred you know, you can't, you just can't do it. It's going to take, take away. You can't be loyal to both. You have to pick one or the other. You know, if you want to be healthier, so you have to be loyal to healthier habits and healthier behaviors. You can't flirt with your old habits that weren't serving you, you know. Um, so my point is just know where your loyalties lie and write them down write write what things you want to be loyal to and you can also write down things ways to be loyal to that thing whatever it is steps or whatever little things that you can do that when your old habits that old pattern creeps up you can refer back to that list and say no i'm going to be loyal to my dreams or goals or my healthy habits or being more loving or forgiving or just having an easier time in life and and I'm not going to go there and this is what I need to do so those are this is something you can do to put you back on track but you have to know where your loyalties lie because if you think you can live in both worlds without sacrificing something you're fooling yourself and you can see that if you look back on your life, you can see what things you've been loyal to and what things you haven't and what the outcomes were. You, there's proof. So don't just take my word for it. Reflect back on your life. And the reason I do this is I want you to be more of a creative thinker in this life. You're Stop just going through life and bouncing around and just, you know. No, I want you to be more in, in charge of what you want to create, you know, what you want for yourself, because you have that power. You know, everything that ever was created was first created in mind. And that's why your thoughts are so powerful. So I want you to be more mindful of how you think and what you're loyal to, because, you know, you can't flirt with other things and expect, you know, nothing to come out of them, because it will. You know, what. It's, you know, you just have to reset your loyalties and that's it. So know what your loyalties are, where they lie. That's all I want you to do because you can have a happier life, a healthier life, if you can learn to take more control of your thoughts and knowing where your loyalties lie is one of the things you can do. So if you have questions, just reach out. I'll be happy to help you. Please click like and share if the video was helpful. Um, there's a link to my YouTube channel 
uh, please subscribe. But just know that it is my heart and soul's intention that you live happier and healthier now because you can. You don't have to suffer in this life. And the happier you become, the healthier you become. Okay, so knowing where your loyalties lie and learning to reset yourself will make you a happier person, which in turn will make you healthier. So reach out if you need, but I got you. So prayers to my first responders out there, prayers to my family and friends. Just know that I love you and got you, and I hope you have a wonderful Halloween. <laughs> and until I see you next week, I love you. Bye. Mwah.